An ambulatory ECG monitor is used for the diagnosis of palpitations or for the diagnosis of blackouts and dizzy spells. It's a small gadget that a patient wears under their clothes and it makes a continuous recording of the patient's ECG for the duration that the monitor is attached. Most patient symptoms occur intermittently and doing an ECG in the clinic room might not always capture the problem. With an ambulatory ECG monitor, we're looking to see what the rhythm of the heart is and how it varies over the space of the 24 hour or 48 hour period that the patient's wearing the monitor. One would expect the heart rhythm to be slow and regular at night when the patient's asleep and to be fast and variable during the day. If the patient's getting dizzy spells or is feeling faint, and if those symptoms are due to an abnormal rhythm of the heart, we should be able to pick that up on the monitor. The monitor is usually fitted in the clinic room. The electrodes are attached to the patient, usually two electrodes uh, on the chest of the patient. And the workings of the monitor are explained. It's actually very straightforward. The a monitor needs to be removed if the patient is having a bath or a shower and can be reattached quite easily afterwards. The monitor itself is, is entirely painless. The electrodes that attach the monitor to the skin can sometimes cause a little bit of discomfort, but especially if you perspire under the monitor. We always provide the patients with spare electrodes so they can replace the pads if at all they're becoming itchy or uncomfortable, and there's usually no long-term problems. The monitor is constantly recording with a timestamp on it, and so as long as the patient tells us when they get symptoms, we can always go back and see what was recorded at the time. The monitor that we use here in the clinic also have a button that the patients can press exactly when they have symptoms. And so it makes it easier to look back through the recording and find out exactly what the heart rhythm was doing. In addition to the standard non-invasive tests that are available in the clinic itself, we have access to a variety of other specialist investigations, both in this hospital and in other specialist clinics around the country.